Uh, the Mazda... <laughs> it's got so many different names. This is the Mazda Roadster S. It's also called the Mazda MX-5. It's also called the Mazda Miata here stateside. Preparing. Preparing the Mazda. The car for hairdressers. So we test the Mazda MX-5 slash Roadster slash Miata. Oh, I messed up, but it's okay because the lap hasn't started yet. I hit the wall a little bit. You missed the Samba bus, man. We ran the Brambulance. Can this thing be faster than the Suzuki Swift? Something I never thought I'd utter. I just did. If the if the Miata does not beat the Suzuki, I mean that's that's embarrassing. That's awful. It's okay, Austin. They'll they'll be up on YouTube. I promise. Oh, okay. Okay. All right, Miata. Let's go. Let's open you up a little bit. I feel like it's slower than the Swift here. That's not... It's not looking good for the Miata. Are you... Are you really the Stig, though? Oh, in the grass a little bit, but we got her. We're good. This car can't open up. But if you can. I mean it's not it's not totally garbage. Is it a car for hairdressers? Yes, of course it is. But it's small, it's light. People actually do race this car. Maybe not in its current state, maybe not in its newer state. But they used to race me out. Spec Miata was a thing, and it was, and it was uh, a strong thing. I don't know why people like racing these things. Not this one, because this car doesn't. I don't think have anything racy about it. I don't. I don't like the design of of this Miata. I didn't change the driving uniform. I got to change it to all white. So we really truly can be the stick. Ooh. Now this, I will say this car, handling not as good as a Swift. That's not surprising. Not at all. Because that thing is just so small. What was it? 856? 857? Somewhere in there? Oh, lost the front end of it a little bit there. Had to chase it into the grass, but we're fine. What about cap hoodies? I don't have any cap hoodies. I will say, though, those Capitals uh, Stadium Series jerseys are really good. I think both the Stadium Series jerseys for both the Caps and, uh, and Maple Leafs. I mean, it's hard to mess up the Maple Leafs jerseys. It really is. Like, no matter what they wear. If it's a modern design like their current uniforms, it'll look good. If it's a throwback like they wore in the 14 Winter Classic, it'll look good. There's n I don't think there's any way... You could truly screw up the Toronto Maple Leafs uniforms. I truly don't. You can mess up the Washington ones. In fact, they did it on their own. With those, uh, with those black, teal, and gold ones. Oh, they have Stadium Series hoodies. Ah! Why couldn't they make one for the Red Wings two years ago? They probably did. It was probably garbage. 
I actually had a stadium series hit, but it wasn't like from uh, NHL shot. It was like from uh, Meyer. That's no good. I don't even remember a Centennial Classic jersey or not jersey, a hoodie for uh, for the Red Wings. And that's honestly that's what the um, Maple Leafs uh, stadium series jerseys remind me of is the. Uh, is the Red Wings Centennial jerseys. Just white, just what they are. Some stripes, some silver. You can mess up Leafs jerseys, it'd be, a, it'd be difficult. Yes, and I mean, they did it back when they were the St. Pats, of course. I mean, those jerseys were just awful. They were just green, just said Toronto St. Pats on them. You just, you flipped the Miata? At the ring? Or where did you flip it? Because now you got me nervous. I could, I could flip this car, completely mess up this lap. Get easy through here. Make sure we don't lose it. Coming up the hill? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God, I had to break hard. I thought the car was going to go way wide. It felt like it was. Beginning of Sector 2? What? You mean the big hill, the jump? How? I didn't get air in this thing. I don't know how you did that. Unless you have a supercharged Miata. Which I'm pretty sure is not a thing in this current Miata. I'm going to get some people yelling at me because I'm calling it the Mazda Miata. I did refer to it by its other names in the, in the top, but in America, it's a Miata. Everywhere else, it's the MX-5, or in the game, it's the Mazda Roadster. I don't know if there's actually some place that calls it the Roadster. I truly don't. I was taking the turn way too fast, and whoop, flip. That's how it happened in the Jag, man. That video that I posted on Twitter a couple months ago, that's how it happened in the Jag. I may not flip any cars today, but I'm going to flip a car in this Nürburgring testing. It's almost a guarantee. I do agree with you on the, on the stadium series thing, though. Like, they, uh, they do. I don't, the stadium series games to me aren't necessary. Winter Classic, if you want to do a second game because it's a special occasion, like uh, the Centennial Classic I liked, the Heritage Classic when they put two Canadian teams at, uh, in it, that I like. Um, stadium series, having more games outside just to have more games is not is not good and you knew the NHL would try and get as much out of this as they could and they and they're just good they're gonna kill a good thing this is gonna be close but I do believe it's gonna beat it yeah but not by a lot the Mazda Miata cross the line at an 854.668 so just two, about two seconds better than the Suzuki Swift. Mazda, you're welcome. You are still, you're still good. You didn't lose to the, to the little tiny Suzuki.